a topic on many minds of late, the federal vaccine mandate and how it could affect you and your job. In Alabama today, the state Senate passed new legislation that encourages those wishing to avoid the vaccine to just fill out a form, truthfully or not. WDHN's Cody Giles joins us now live from the newsroom with details on that legislation and some community reaction to the mandate itself. Cody? Well, Amanda, there was, sorry, it definitely seems that it doesn't matter if you are vaccinated or not. Opinions on mandating the vaccine seem to be different. Today, Alabama lawmakers advanced legislation aimed at protecting employees who choose not to get vaccinated against COVID-19 by setting out an easy process to claim a religious or medical exemption, even if the information isn't necessarily true. The Alabama Senate voted 26 to 5 for the bill, which would mandate businesses requiring COVID-19 vaccinations to distribute a form where employees could claim a religious or medical exemption simply by checking a box. But some lawmakers, such as Democratic Senator Bobby Singleton, believe this is a bad thing, stating, quote, we as a legislature are about to manufacture an excuse for people not to take the vaccine and everybody will claim some sort of illness. Many lawmakers have already expressed discontent with this vaccine mandate, and the same goes for at least one resident here in the Wiregrass. People should have that freedom to be able to, to stand for what they believe in uh, and uh, take care of their own health according to what they think is necessary. However, there are other citizens in the area who aren't sure why people are scared of the vaccine. They are in favor of the mandate. I'm guessing a lot of folks going off of what other folks, uh, the media, Facebook, or whatever, saying, but I'm all... Uh, for, you know, just doing what you got to do to take care of yourself and take care of everyone that's around you. But firing people who don't get the vaccine could pose more issues for many people. I don't think people should be fired uh, for for the reasons of, of whether or not they want to take a vaccine, something that uh, is concerning their own health. I realize how that may affect other people, but um, lose, the loss of a job also affects other people. Republic, Republican Representative rather Mike Ball of Huntsville says if the legislation on the vaccine mandates doesn't pass during this executive session, Governor Kay Ivey can call another session in the future. Back to you, Amanda.